this brings me to another part of history. Uh, you know, we refer to Bell Labs and uh, Skunk Works a lot as like these transformative programs in or, or the Manhattan Project in the 20th century where a lot of inventions, groundbreaking inventions happen, happened, which have prob probably shaped a lot of like even the 21st century, right? The transistor, sure. the, uh, the semiconductor, uh, the, the stealth fighter jet, you know, so much yeah. came out of it uh, that we were boasting a few months ago, right? So much from those programs in the 20th century. And you don't hear about an equivalent in, in the last 25 years or the last like 30-ish years. And you keep, you know, nostalgically keep referring back to, you keep hearing these examples of, oh, wow, we, we need a program like this, or we wish. Well, uh, like people that. say we need, like, yeah, how many times people use, like, we need another Manhattan project, yes. right? So so you, so like, you keep you hearing this, you right? At forever. some point, it needs but, to become history. <laughs> so uh, at the end of World War II, he wrote a paper fairly well known in terms of the creation of where the U.S. went in science. He created a paper for the president, President Truman at the time, really suggesting that we need to develop a model to promote technology. 